All right, Marv, what you got for us? All right, we're headed back to Warner Robins. Hoko taking out the juggernaut of defending yeah. a state champ. Elite County looking to gain their first win in the region play to join the playoff hunt. And they would battle to the finish at Freedom Field. Hoko and Lee County in the third. Bears leading 17-14. And the Locos are smelling upset. Trojans come up with a little luck right here. Kyle Toole to Emery. Low, 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 low. Squares up and fumbles the football. His teammate, James Hobson, the second, uh, oh. scoops and scores and just breaks the plane. And it's 21-17, Lee County. Uh. Yeah, when things are going your way. They're going your way. Bears defense playing stand-up defense for most of the game. Big third down stop by Daniel Armendariz, giving the ball back to the Hoko offense. Ball in great field position for the Bears, but back-to-back -back sacks. Yeah, pushes Hoko line of scrimmage 33 yards away and the force to punt on downs. Now still in the third, the Bears on the march again after they give that ball over there. Marvin a little long with the edit, but here they go. Lee County is chasing, chasing, chasing. No, that's going to be a pass from nice Max Rigby to Isaiah Harris, and that goes inside the five-yard line, looking to square up in the fourth quarter. Bears very much alive, but they would get a field goal out of the game, and it's 24-20. Here they go. Fourth down, and it's oh. not to be. The Bears had a couple chances in the end zone to try to win the ball game, but they come up just a little bit short. Zaxby's FFN scoreboard. Oh. Lee County steals the victory, 24-20.